A new man passing by. Life is good. Best I've ever felt. Hi, you guys. We have officially taken a whole week off <laughs> from filming, aside from the chicken video, and I never got Jason's reaction. <laughs> <laughs> it was as mild as mine was, to I, be fair. Yeah, I was just like, oh, so we're gonna get eggs? And she's like, no. I'm like, what do you mean? They're roosters. And I'm like, what the good are, oh, what good are roosters? <laughs> like, if you're not getting eggs, why? And then just because she didn't want them killed. She loves animals. I don't know if I, I think I explained it. They're Jacob's family's chickens. From the batch they got, they thought more wouldn't make it. You always get more than you think. There's <laughs> a lot die. Kaylee's out here with them right now. Are they coming out to play? Um, but the two roosters were not going to stay with the family. Had to go somewhere and Kaylee didn't want them to go somewhere. <laughs> So, yeah, there's there is we'll it was my the future around. brings. Yeah, whatever. It's, it's she's being responsible. Yeah. They did the right thing. They've been doing really good with them. Chelsea is Chelsea and Ashley are both excellent with them. Um, they come out here. So in that regard, I actually oh, hang on. She comes out here to play with them. Chelsea and Ashley come out here all the time, huh? When Kaylee's gone, which you've actually like been gone. So Jacob is more often this week or this past week than before we had chickens. <laughs> but Chelsea likes to play with them. Are they back behind? Yeah. We need to come out here and clean. I think that's good leave. Whoa. They're getting big even just in the week we've had them. But uh, they love rooting around underneath here. So normally I rake up all this stuff, but they like to like peck at it. Hi, are you curious over here? What can you get o into over here? They just like to peck and dig and be good, be good. <laughs> so I think I'm just gonna leave the ground cover because it gives them something to do. Okay, okay, okay. What are, you, what are we doing? Just very curious. So they're here to stay for now. Yeah, you can pick all those out, all the little weeds. Keep going. Oh, you're not going in the house. I'm going to go over here. <laughs> also, that little noise, that's all the noise they make. Yeah, that's perfect. Do that. If they can pluck it. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, you're going to go for the door. Okay, I'm going to go in. <laughs> you're not coming in this door. They were, this is how close I was to the door. You're not coming in here. Yeah, pick all those little weeds. That'd be fantastic. Okay, we... I thought I was going to, like film more along this morning of just running errands. I've been his little chauffeur for a little bit this morning. He's been doing stuff for work and I literally don't have any more videos to edit for the first time in a week. I've gotten caught up. I edited 10 videos after we got home from our trip because I didn't really edit while I was there. I did, but I didn't. It's not the same. Not the same. Um, but I got talking to my niece. She ended up calling me and her and her husband are gonna go to Tokyo. They're gonna go to Japan this summer. And he um, served, her husband served a mission in Tokyo as well as Jason did 30 years ago. Well, so, I was in Nagoya, but Here yeah. in Nagoya, Japan. Um, so they're thinking of going and doing Tokyo and Kyoto. And, and so we were just talking with them and it was just really fun to like, see that they're wanting to go and travel before they have kids and stuff. And so that was kind of fun, but, um, we're, we still have to go to Costco. I'm not really getting any food aside from like breakfast drinks, I think. Uh, we need syrup. Oh, we do need syrup. I'm gonna add that to the list. We'll have to add I'm gonna list. But right now we're going somewhere fun. Uh, great little place. We'll show you as soon as we get there. Why are you being so dramatic about it? Because this is the exciting reason why part of our day. Exciting. This is the exciting Exc part of our day. Okay, we're out. Come back soon. So, it's not really that exciting. <laughs> We're just going to Chick-fil-A. But the advantage is, and he literally just like said it out loud, is that I am driving and I don't get stressed with this line. 
He's already been like, oh, we're not going to make it through this. Like, no, I said you wouldn't have. If you I got know he there, didn't. You have I know. I don't think he'll make it through the light. That's not stress. That's called reality. I understand. But the amount of stress you have to go. You're the to... one that almost missed the lane because I'm like, are we going to Chick fil A? I know, I and forgot. Like, dive back in. You don't want me commenting on. Okay, whatever. We're going to Chick fil A for lunch. Um, he's a horrible backseat driver, but I don't want to get <laughs> mad again. I'm already mad at him. I get mad at him every single time we drive together, so that's a lot of times during the week. So, we're gonna go get Chick fil A. I wonder if Abby's. Oh, she's in class. She might actually. She'll just eat my leftovers. I'll just get one that she can have leftovers of mine. So, not too exciting. And then we'll go to Costco. So we have Costco, and then I've gotta go redo the file. I'll go out on my own. We mainly need, like, dish detergent, laundry detergent, like, actual, like, household goods. Not syrup. necessarily. Extra little well, syrup, but it's not like I'm eating syrup every day. It's not like milk, eggs, yeah, bread. Yeah. It's just little extra cheese. periphery stuff. I am remembering a few things. Oh, we do need cheese, yes. Okay. And it's worth the wait. Got our drinks. Got our food. We're going to go find a park. Okay. Came to the park. Got a nice view. And we got nice food. And we're listening to Taylor Swift, but now that we're stopped, we're going to probably turn on a show or something. All right, have we enjoyed our food? Mm-hmm. Yep, we're just sitting here in this beautiful, beautiful sunny day, just eating a little food. I am full, so now we head home. I gotta do a few errands after yeah, I'm back out. Oh, we going to Costco? Yeah, we have to go to Costco. I purposely like order a size that I know I can only eat half of. That's good. And so then I take the other half home to Abby. So I'm gonna text her now. She likes Chick-fil-A as well, and she doesn't eat out. She doesn't eat out her She has all. like two things. She likes Subway and she likes Chick fil A. Whoa. Here. <laughs> the string. Caught it. Alright. Let's go to Costco. You told me there'd be better days. And nothing that can pull us under. You want to take the pain away. But know that I was born as a fight. We fail, we fail, but we're better than that. We're better than that. I know, you know, so are we holding on, holding on? All right, we're home. Next up, our to do tasks. And I'm saying this on camera because I've had this conversation with Jason like 40 million times. We need to go work in the backyard and try and clean up the little algae on the patio. We're not cutting branches. <laughs> I've had this conversation with him many times. And in the car, okay, when we go home, we're gonna work in the backyard. And he's like, okay, yeah, I'll go cut some branches. No, <laughs> we're not cutting branches today. It's his favorite thing to do. We need to clean out the patio. Can I put on headphones on my ass to listen to you? I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> I am done with you. So Where's listen your vinegar? to vinegar. Go get your vinegar. No, you help out. I am helping out. No, you're not. Go get the vinegar. You know where it is. Where? Don't BS with me. It's right there in the closet. Oh, okay, I didn't. I don't keep track of the vinegar. I'm turning on a podcast. I'm not listening to him. <laughs> okay, no, no, no. Let's just let's let's work on bigger picture first before we do this. What's the bigger picture? The whole thing. Why would start from top down? Clean okay. all this up so it goes down, gets everything wet. Okay, I, I want to move these away from it then. Let's move the benches back off the thing because we also need to like wash off the... We need to move and wash off the rug. I understand, but I was going to do this so the water just goes down, the vinegar goes down. I don't want the vinegar on the rug is what I'm trying to tell you. Okay, we've lifted everything off of the main part. Yeah. The rug did. We don't really have a pressure washer. Let me get the broom and brush it. Okay. All right, well, it's not the best. It's a lot better than it was. Um, but we ran out of vinegar. We sprayed, or we dumped vinegar all over everywhere. This area definitely didn't get any vinegar. So we're just leaving that wet for now. We're gonna put the rug back. I sprayed off most of it. So we're just gonna lay it back out, put the couches back, but we need to work on the other half of this area. I'll go get more vinegar. I'm also going to get two rugs, an outdoor and an indoor, or maybe two outdoors. This isn't going to fly with me all, all summer. Meanwhile, Chelsea's home <laughs> having lunch. And we're still busy out here. 
Um, we put Dawn soap all over the whole rug. Ah, oh, that got rust or something on there. What is that? It's from the bottom of this. Ugh. But the Dawn soap worked great. And we figured Dawn is great for ducks, so it's fine for chickens. Um, sprayed everything this way. Everything was kind of piled here like you saw. So now we're going to come back and scrub this. The Dove, not the Dove, Dawn soap um, worked great. As you can see right here, kind of showed everything to this area underneath where these were at. And so now we need to clean out everything else. Okay, it's all done. Um, we still have some rust stains now from the fireplace. We move the fireplace over there until we use it, then we'll get it away from the trees. Um, and we've had to push the couch out this direction so that the kids can walk through here and check on the chickens. But I'm gonna go now and get an outdoor rug to go here and possibly even an outdoor rug here as well. You want to shut that gate? I promised that. I uh, wash your car, so I do that. Oh, okay. All right, I have changed back into my other clothes. I should have just left my tank top and shorts on. I thought I was getting, I was getting cold back in the backyard because of the shade back there. It's just right there. Um. Now I'm in my car and I'm hot because the sun's still out, out here. But, um, there's the neighbor's kid. Um, not all activities between Jason and I, AKA any husband and wife, <laughs> go peachy keen. I need some space for him, he needs some space for me. We'll just, we'll just say that. Um, so. That's why I didn't show, usually in projects like that, I can show our banter and there was no banter that I would have been appropriate <laughs> to bring online. Um, and I laugh now, but I'm still mad. So the backyard looks great. It's all cleaned up and uh, I'm gonna go take some time by myself. I'm trying to get out of here before the buses stop me. Okay, here at the rugs and one of my tests so I have to be able to stand on it with bare feet, in or out. So this one here is the only rugged one that could go outside. This is an indoor, is this one indoor or outdoor? On slip, easy clean, high traffic. I'm assuming all purpose is inside out. Um, I could do this one inside, um, but I think I'll do this one outside but I still need to be able to stand up on it with bare feet. Okay, these are my two rugs of choice. This is, no, nope, that's not it. Uh-oh. That one came from a different section. This is not the same rug. Okay, that one doesn't go there. That one is not the same. This is what it looks like up close. So this is the indoor one, and then I'll do that one as my outdoor one. I'm also gonna get one of these trays to put shoes in either out, outside during the summer. Right now with it still kind of rainy and stuff, I'll probably have it inside the door. I don't know, we'll just see. But I want them to put their shoes um, on this because um, it just is annoying. You saw where they are right now and that's not gonna fly with me. Okay, Ash, you can demonstrate. Shoes you really off. Need to demonstrate. Shoes off. Put it in the tray. Smile. But really, no, we're not getting donuts. Um, so we got the outside mat here. We do kind of have a problem. I actually might go get another one of these because when they stand over here in the mud, and right now it's a problem because this is all wet, but we do still get rain. And so it's going to be muddy over here. Then they come over here with muddy. And I already had to spray this off again because it was just filled with mud and dirt. So I don't know if, it's, if the answer is another mat like that or if we just have to kind of deal with the mud until summertime. All right, I went upstairs to be by myself for a little bit and uh, Jason made us these little, I mean, they're little pot stickers, little gyozas, but they're teeny tiny and some rice. And then you have to I make- I had to hand pinch them, it was really tricky. No, you, 
<laughs> you had to hand pinch the package from the freezer. <laughs> and you have to make your own sauce with these ones. I'll show you what ones they are from Costco. And she's chicken and cilantro. We had to make your own sauce. So, anyway. Okay, we got bored. Jason's kind of loving Trader Joe's these That's days. Some fun little snacks and little doodads. He ran out of his gummy bears, gummy spring gummies. Something, but they're like uh, more natural or something. I don't know, whatever. I read the ingredients, they're better. So we went and got those. I'm gonna show you what else we got. Obviously, we were a little snacky after dinner. Okay, so he got his gummies. These are awesome. I wouldn't have come, but if I did, then I'm gonna get these. And then we got another one of those for the girls. And I finally found hash browns for Chelsea. She loves these, and I do too. Um, and then Kaylee always gets these. And I thought it would be fun, like on a Saturday morning, Sunday morning, to make these. You just have to let them prove overnight. So you have to <laughs> know ahead of time that you want to make them. But you had to get two boxes. This is why we can't shop here. We don't make anything big enough for. So the two extra. Because everyone that really shops here has 0.9 babies. I know, or none. <laughs> <laughs> 